what is Simon here? Another bar story. Kirby. Kirby first contact. Well, yeah. Patea. Kirby was working in the FLB bar. And that bar had a, a forum. And it's before I ventured to Thailand, way back before the bar time, I found that forum and chatted on it. And uh, when I went to Thailand, I frequented the FLB bar. Now, the f one of the first times, it was before I started the bar job, I'd been in a few times, it was actually the first time I saw Kirby. Real name, Knock. Um, I saw her a couple of times. But once I'd got the job working in the bar, um, sometimes I'd go there with some customers who wanted big parties and that sort of thing. And one evening, uh, with a friend of mine, a customer, it was I had a night off. I wasn't working. I was going to let my hair down. Yeah, I know. And we went to the FLB bar. Now. That was the only time, and the closest I came to having an, having an account, encounter with Kirby. Um, sat at the back of the bar. It's quite a, a long bar from the walking street in the middle of walking street, from all the way back to the water because it sort of came out level with the beach. So it was a long, thin bar, but at the back it opened up. One bar where all the drinks were were uh, issued but there was another bar tucked at the side of the back which had poles on so sort of a little stage but it was an old bar so there were girls dancing on there and lots and lots of girls in the FLB bar lots going on all the time lots of seats and sofas settees at the back you could relax and chill out and the night in question was my first contact with Kirby because she came on to me um, and started talking and getting friendly. However, it was short-lived. Now this also follows on to the video I did about girls fighting in bars. It's one of those nights you just cannot forget. There was a gentleman who decided to have a have a birthday party in the FLB bar. Now this gentleman was a semi-professional, don't know the difference, but I don't think he was quite ready for professional basketball player. He was, to me, he looked eight foot tall, but he was probably six foot eight, maybe more, but he was tall. He was from somewhere North Africa, dark skin, very thin, athletic, very, very tall. And he'd organized and he'd paid some money that he'd keep getting shots, the little shot um, drinks and drinks and girls attention and later in the evening some girls would be up on that stage doing different games and he would be one of the judges to mark which one was the best and then he'd get to take the winner home at the end of the evening as part of his package that he'd paid um, a few hours in we were getting a little bit merry and this guy was drinking they kept Flying him with B-52s, which is an amazing shot, my favourite by far, quite strong. And he happened to be in the middle, just stood not far in front of me and my friend, stood sort of jigging about a bit. Now the FLB bar had two top girls that were sort of equal, um, that were the best girls in the bar, and they were the top dogs. And from what I could see, Kirby was below them she was um, she wasn't the top dog but she was always busy and when the top girls get stepped on by a girl from lower down it causes problems now we're just sat there drinking watching everything that's going on it's just busy always something to look at in there in those days and Kirby although she was sh showing me some attention bell got rang and that was it she was off um, and it was a different guy who rung the bell she went off and paid a bit of attention to them 
and then on her route, sort of coming back towards me, I thought, you know, this is a nice girl. The basketball player grabbed her and started chatting to her. Now, just out of the blue, music's going, everyone's happy. Kirby suddenly started. She opened the, the doors. She became the dentist right in the middle of everything guy stood up she started the oral extraction process right there in the bar and he stood up and people are watching i mean right in the middle of the night she suddenly just removes his shorts he had shorts on i remember and starts the oral extraction process unbelievable i have never seen that happen outside of soy six not in especially a big bar like this with there was a good i would say 50 people in there <laughs> and she just there his sedative was the b52s <laughs> and the dentist moved in kirby went in for the kill now those two top girls they were at different parts of the bar and i didn't know which those girls were but soon became apparent both of them saw what Kirby was doing and because he was like the party guest and paid they thought assumed that immediately you know that he's theirs at the end of the night they were going to win the contest later and that would be it maybe two at once buy one get one free and uh, they both came across and the one girl now I've seen this almost happen in Soy 6 where the person fell over. I mentioned on another video. All I can remember seeing was Kirby was in the process and the one girl stood. So the guy's here, Kirby's here, and she smacked Kirby's forehead. A hell of a smack. At the same time that Kirby was doing an extraction. That could have been really dangerous. That could have... <laughs> that poor guy. And Kirby... She, this girl knocked Kirby backwards. Um, released, luckily. At that point, the other girl came in. And the three of them just started brawling in the middle of the bar. Hair pulling the assistant manager um I think it was ben i think he now runs secrets club or whatever that's called now but uh, he jumped in and broke it all up but the one girl had given kirby a a good black eye at the red at the time but it was going to be black oh dear not good kirby had stepped out of line she'd gone above those two girls but right in the middle of the bar three girls brawling that's not good that's not good at all but they did they smacked kirby you know get off he's our customer you're out of line um it was very amusing at the time and they could have things could have gone wrong very quickly for that guy and straight afterwards the two girls went back to work in fact one of them stayed with that guy Kirby was uh, just disappeared so I think she was probably sent home for the evening but that was that was nearly my that was my only night that I could have indulged as a single guy well, in fact no well yes before her and uh, Apple before I knew they were friends that was the only time I missed out in fact if Kirby is still in Patea she would be maybe Ben at Secrets if he's still there she could well be there could well be there so there they were brawling and this guy uh, later in the evening he did the uh, judging of the girls dancing and things on this little stage and other things they were doing with bananas and all sorts of different things <laughs> and he went home at the end of the evening a happy we were hammered long evening never saw kirby again that evening but she didn't get fired because 
several occasions after I went in there and she was there. But again, girls brawling, all down to the top dog thing. If the girl's top of the bar, she gets first pick. And Kirby stepped over the mark. Um, don't do it. <laughs> girls, don't do it. No, but yeah, there we are. Kirby in a fight. That was the first contact really with me and Kirby. What a shame. <sighs> but that guy had a very good evening. There we go. I will see you on the next video. Bye for now.